Mrs. Pant, thank you so much for meeting me. Um, first of all, I just wanted to say how sorry we are for your loss. We didn't really know Val that well. And then um, what were you doing with her dog? Well, when she passed, there was nobody here to collect her things, so as far as we knew, she didn't have any relatives. Well, you knew wrong. What? I live in Bendigo. It took a while for Valerie's lawyer to contact yeah, me. I get that, I get that. But back then, we didn't know that. So my husband and I, we, we offered to take little Reggie in. And since then, we've, um, we've fallen in love with her. I mean, she's so cute. She's so playful and cuddly. And we're actually going through quite a bit at the moment. Um, and she's been a really good help for us. So of course, we, we desperately, desperately want to keep her. And I, I understand, like, French Bulldogs are very expensive, but we'd be prepared to buy her from you. I think she was bequeathed to me by my late sister. She had no one else in her life, and nor do I. I meant to call her more than I did, but we fought about something. I can't remember what it was now. <laughs> I was waiting for her to ring first. At least she wasn't alone in the end. She had Regina, and that would have meant something to her. She would have been the last face my sister saw. Look, I'm not going to take your money. If you want Regina, you'll have to do it through a judge.